first time I went through it. Um, I mean, it, it's tough. It's tough. It's it's pretty uh, exhausting. Um, just getting the timing down, getting a rhythm going. I mean, just where you want to pick the ball up. Like, there's there's a lot that goes into it that I didn't even realize. So, um, but my all, all the coaches, um, some assistant coaches, you know, they were they were in the gym with me, getting getting me ready, reading the rules, and um, even they they got in it with me. So we kind of went through like a whole competition and. Um, I came, came out with a, a win on both days, so uh, that made me feel a little good. But uh, but yeah, no, it's it's a takes a takes a little bit to get used to. Um, but hopefully, you know, I kind of got it going. Are you expecting? Uh, you mentioned this before, but now that we're getting closer to it, are you expecting family and friends, like a number of them, to be there? Yeah, definitely. Um, I not like my entire family will be there. Um, I know some other friends and some family friends that they're going to make the trip um up to cleveland and uh i know i had some friends text me saying that tickets were crazy um but they're just going to cleveland just to like hang out and just be around everything and um so that was pretty cool so i definitely have a a decent group that's that's going up there and uh gonna be cheering me on so it'll be it'll be a fun weekend I'm, i'm excited just to get back to ohio and um just enjoy it and uh you know just just have fun with it Hey, Lou, congrats on the win and uh, good luck this weekend. You, you talked about the past several weeks, teams are being really physical with you, trying to run you off the line. Uh, with Kawhi, PG, and Norm out, it feels like you're getting the maximum attention from defenses each night. What are these reps going to do for you once those guys get back? Yeah, no, it's uh, it's going to be great. I mean, it just kind of brings confidence up a little bit. Um, and just being ready to shoot. I mean, I know when we have guys like Kawhi, PG, Norm, guys that, you know, attract so much attention. Um, either I'm going to be, you know, wide open with with their playmaking abilities and, uh, you know, just how much attention they they attract or, you know, with me, um, you know, possibly being on the court with them and just giving them as much space um, as, you know, as, as they can have and just let them do what they do. Um, but, you know, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm excited to, to get them back whenever that may be. You know, it's um, it's tough when you have guys out like, like, like those guys, but, um, no, I'm definitely excited to, to see how it can work. Um, and just, you know, getting these reps in, like you said, um, just building that confidence, being a, a knockdown shooter. I think it's just gonna, you know, take our team up a, a lot when, when we can get those guys back. Luke, uh, we, we talked before about them, basically defenses like not letting you shoot, you know, uh, forget the, percentages the volume like what was different tonight uh, compared to basically the last two weeks yeah um I think the last few games that I played um there were like some shots that I turned down um and I think tonight I I've shot some some tougher shots some some uh I definitely had some like tougher tougher looks tonight and that's what that's what the like the coaches wanted me to do I watched film on it and you know, any kind of space, they want me to, to get it off. And I, I thought that I, you know, kind of had the mindset tonight of um, just just doing that. You know, last last game going into the break, let's just try to work on some of the things that, that I saw the last few games. And um, But, you know, we, we have some really good screeners on the team that, that allowed me to, to get open. And um, there was a play at the end of the game where I think I uh, – that Isaiah, you know, we, we, we started working on something where he just – I had like a guy's denying me and he dribbles under the guy. It's like, you know, a Draymond and, and Steph thing. Like we're, we're starting to just figure out different ways to, to get open when, when we notice that teams are being a little more aggressive. So we're, we're trying to work on some different things and um, different actions that create just a little bit of space. And when I had that space, I just have to take advantage of it and try to uh, get the, get the shot off. I've been curious actually, when it comes to you and the coaches, is there any one coach, one assistant coach, because we all know Todd, he gets on you. Well, is there any one assistant coach who has really been on you about anything, just making sure you stay aggressive? Yeah, I mean, all of them. All of them. I, f- I feel like anytime I come to the bench or I'm running down the, down the floor, I mean, I feel like I'm hearing something from everybody. And, uh, you know, and it, it feels good. You know, it, like it's it's a it's definitely a confidence booster when you when you got a, a coaching staff that that believes in you and, and any shot that you take and they don't get mad when you shoot and uh you know it just kind of lets us play free and just um, do what we do and um that's what makes it really enjoyable playing for a group like that 
Luke, uh, when you look at the uh, contestants with you in the three-point contest, I don't think there's a previous winner in this one. So who do you think, uh, kind of, I don't know, I don't want to scare you, but who's going to be the toughest competition, do you think? Oh, man. Um, I mean, there's definitely some really good shooters. Um, but, you know, guys with, with quick shots, it's, it's going to be, um, if they have a quick shot and just can get a rhythm going, um, you know, it's going to be tough. I don't know. I mean, there's any, any guy can get hot or just have an off night. So hopefully I'm one of those that is getting hot. Uh, but, um, I don't know. I guess we'll see. I know like Trey will be good. Desmond Bain will be good. I mean, I don't know. There's going to be a, a few guys that'll, uh, definitely give some, some good competition. Nico's been working on that quick release. I don't know if you get in the gym with him on that. <laughs> oh yeah. Nico, uh, he's a, he's a mass. He, I mean, he works on that every day. The no, like the no dip catch and shoot. He works on that every day. And, uh, when he, when he hit one the other night, it was, uh, he said, finally, like, but he needs to do it more often. We tell him like, we need to do that more often. And, uh, I don't know. I'm, I don't think I'm quite to that level yet. That's, that's a tough shot. That's one of the most difficult shots you can shoot in the NBA, but, uh, I don't know. Nico's a master at it. It looks you won the like McDonald's All American three point contest back in the day, yeah. Yep. When you were doing that, like in your mind, you're like, I'm gonna do this someday at the NBA All Star. Um, I mean, it was definitely a goal. Uh, I mean, I grew up watching, and I mentioned it uh, maybe like once it first got announced that I was gonna be in it. Uh, you know, I grew up watching like all all the All Star you know events and everything, and. I love the dunk contest, but I mean, obviously, like I'm, I'm not going to be in the dunk contest anytime soon. Uh, so yeah, you know, I look to the three point contest and, uh, <laughs> um, and it's, it's going to be fun. I'm excited and, um, I just want to enjoy it. Like I'll be there for, for a few days and I just want to, you know, enjoy every moment of it. You know, my family will be there. So it's going to be a really cool event. And, uh, you know, I'm just excited it's back home, home in Ohio. You know, I've had a lot of support all over Ohio, just, I mean, when I was in high school, we, we played all over, the, all over the state and um, there was just support everywhere, even when I was in college and now the NBA, just Ohio's home. So like it's uh, it's, it's going to be a really cool, cool thing just to be back and see some family and friends and just just want to enjoy it and have fun with it. You're, you're kind of like famously competitive, right? Like what do you say? You're kind of famously competitive, like oh, all yeah. things, right? It's like yeah. golfing, <laughs> fishing. So, um, mm -hmm. I mean, so this you, you want to get that done. Definitely. I definitely want to win. I want to win for, you know, Clipper Nation and uh, represent well. But um, you know, at the same time, just just getting invited and just being able to, to be there, the opportunity is just um, really cool. So just like I said, I'm just going to enjoy it and whatever happens, happens. See. Yep. Thanks, guys. Yep.